Hi, I have the treat of sitting here with Colin Firth and Emily Blunt together, together again at together last, again. finally, uh, for their film Arthur Newman, where they both play Americans, which I kind of love that. You're like twangy, like Midwest kind of flatline American. <laughs> Make a was sound so blah, but I guess that was the part. Well, it wasn't a comment on anybody else, uh, it was mm -hmm. just this guy. Yeah. Um, and, uh, you know. In, in a way, you just have to leave your sort of cultural reference points at the do at the door when you start. Mm -hmm. You know, when you get in front of the camera, it's just—he's a man who feels he's from nowhere. It's mm -hmm. sort of set nowhere. Mm -hmm. um, in fact, you know, I think the, the original geography of the script was completely different. We just happened to shoot where we did. Uh, but obviously, you're both playing American, and I heard about how they. I guess it's two doctors that produced this film or something, like where the money yeah. came from. It's kind of a great story about not your typical financiers, but how, what made you want to do this movie? Um, I think because it just felt sort of singular and um, completely original and uncompromising. And um, I think you read a lot of scripts which you feel like you've read them before many, many times, and mm -hmm. I think people feel like they need, uh, you know, a big redeeming scene, or they need big payoffs, or they need, you know, I think audiences are sort of, and, and me as an actor, I, I've been sort of tricked into reading scripts like that and thinking, oh God, well, where's the, where's the big moment where they hug, or sort of, you know. Mm -hmm. And so I almost had to trick my brain into uh, reading in a different way with this script, which I really liked, you know. I was like, oh no, this is actually, this is actually what originality is. It, it keeps changing its nature for me, this story, you know. Mm -hmm. Sometimes I think it's all quite funny, mm -hmm. and other times mm -hmm. I think it's achingly sad. Mm -hmm. and, and the same thing, I think it all happens in that moment, where she does something which got quite big laughs when we saw it today. <laughs> yeah, mm -hmm. I didn't expect but that. No, and it's, you know, because it, it is so, it's such a bizarre thing to do, is to put, you know, suddenly go into someone's house and appear as this kind of rather ghostly bridal mm -hmm. figure. <laughs> But he succumbs mm -hmm. because he wants a hug, basically. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You know, yeah. he just can't bear being lonely any longer. Yeah. And if he has to put on a silly voice to do yeah. it, then so He'll be do it. it. Yeah. yeah. That's great. Now, have you guys ever, I mean, if memory serves me, I don't think you've ever worked together, but I could be. We have not. Right? And we never will again. Yeah. And that's it. I yeah. knew that was coming. Yeah. We will work together again. <laughs> I'm finding something now for us. Yeah. <sighs> well, that's good. This well, it's great. Well, it's great to see you guys great again. It's always love seeing you. you and, um, too. Good luck with it. Good luck with the, the Tom Cruise movie. Thank you. And you with getting back to your life for a minute. Yeah, or two. unemployment is what she Yeah, means. good yeah. luck with that. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Sleepless nights. Yeah. Waiting through. All right, guys. <laughs>